Here we are on the 18th of May at Little Grass Dryer Field, which was the oilseed rape field that we planted with the Missouri strip till drill. And as I pan across the, uh, the whole field there, it's a very, very even crop of oilseed rape, even up against the track there. Um, very, very pleased with it. It's um, probably just gone past full flower now. We've just taken the decision to put a second fungicide on it. The first one was Felan, Boscolid. Um, that went on towards the end of April. And um, with the cold weather and the wet weather, the flowering has been quite prolonged. So uh, the sclerotinia risk, I think, is going to be building with some warmer temperatures. So we've decided to go through again with Kestrel, which is uh, Tebuconazole and Prothiconazole just at half a litre, just to uh, just to give it a bit of extra sclerotinia sort of cover, really. And if I just hop down here to the plant level, um, we can see a reasonably good pod set, um, which is quite good. Those pods will be filling up now. They've obviously had plenty of moisture now. What they need is sunshine. There is quite a lot of petal stick, which is one of the reasons, really, to go through with the, the sort of booster second fungicide, I feel. Um, these petals that are falling now would not have been covered with the original fungicide and um, <coughs> so they, they kind of need to uh, they need to be protected where the, le where the petals are sticking on the leaves um, if they're infected with sclerotinia then that could be uh, that could be quite a risk the stems uh, the stems of these plants if I can just get down in here it's quite a lot of petal fall really. Um, so that could be all we need to do to this crop. Um, might get desiccated at harvest although it's quite an even even crop we might not although with the prolonged flowering period uh, there could be quite a, a range of timings really re um, ready for harvest so it might be that we desiccate to try and even things up. We'll make that decision a bit closer to the time when we've uh, we've had another couple of months of weather, um, but so far very very happy.